What is going on guys? My name is Hussain and uh, I ran into a very interesting situation today with Postgres, databases, indexes, shared memory and I'd like to share this problem with you guys because it was really interesting because I'd never run into this before. So I was executing a query that is going through an execution pan of index only scan and then I talked about index only scans in my channel and in my courses before and that's the idea of the content that you're selecting including the search space and the values that you're pulling are all in the index that means Postgres do not need to jump into the heap table which all the data resides to fetch any of the columns because the columns are in the index. So what I did is I created an index um, and I included my non-key columns in the index as non-key values so that they can be fetched without going to the heap. So all looks good. So I queried that and the planner does say, hey, I executed an index only scan, but it was so slow. It, it took around three seconds to execute. So I was like really surprised. Then I took a look at the planner and it says, heap fetch 10,000. Like, what? Why are you going to the heap? So I dug them and, and, and you might say, I say, did you run a vacuum? I did run a va full vacuum on my table. That means all the rows should be visible to all transactions, right? So there's no need for you to go back on the heap to check whether that row is visible to you as a transaction or not. Right? So I was surprised and full, uh, when you do a vacuum full table, it just says done. It doesn't tell you I found this much, I cleared this much. So I searched online and there was, fair enough, someone ran into this exact same problem, but the cause was different. <laughs> okay, let's go in. So they suggested to do a vacuum full verbose. And when I did that, fair enough, it says, hey, by the way, the vacuum did not complete successfully because uh, I could not extend the shared amount of memory. And shared memory, if you don't know, guys, is an amount of memory that is accessible to multiple processes, the shared memory. Because, you know, memory is accessible for their pair process basis, right? A shared memory is a location that you can put stuff into and, and, and uh, essentially all processes can access it and Postgres rely on this very heavily because one process could read a page from disk and pull it into the shared memory cache and other processes can hit that beautiful cache without actually needing to fetch the disk. So my shared memory was a Docker container which was apparently something I didn't know that it's a default to 64 megabyte and that query and that table was huge it was 50 million so definitely it couldn't run a full vacuum to actually uh, clean the transaction rows, to, to, to clean the rows, to make all the rows visible so that the table, uh, so that the transaction don't have to go back to the heap to check if the row is visible to it, whether, whether it's deleted or, or uh, the scope of the isolation of the transaction is visible or not, all that stuff, right? So that was, uh, that was it. I increased the shared memory full, run vacuum full verbose this time, and guess what? All cleaned. Uh, the, the transaction now the table is the row tables are all visible to the uh, to the transactions that means when I did an index scan guess what it did an index only scan and it did not have to go to the heap and it finished in three milliseconds hope that uh, kind of I, I like to share these kind of real life things that it took me two hours to figure that all out but the, the purpose of this video is guys you gonna always run into problems like this and the beauty of searching and and getting to the bottom of it is what makes you a better software engineer and i am going to run into these problems all the time and the god the, the 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 main point here is you have to dig deeper and dig deeper and get to the bottom of what caused the problem and feels really good when you actually find out what was the problem all right, guys, I'm here in beautiful Julian. It's an area near us, mountainous area. We're here to try some pies. They have really good pies. All right, guys, I'm going to see you in the next one. Happy New Year again, and goodbye.